Hello, my name is Frederick Anefi. Stay safe, learn Excel under two minutes. Today we are going to look at how to find duplicate based on two columns and also use it as a validation um, rule to really validate our data for us in terms of entry. So to do that, we'll use a conditional formatting to select the data that's the two columns. Go to conditional formatting, go to new rule. We we'll use the end function, so we'll use, use a formula to determine which cells to format. Introduce equal sign, we type our end function, open our bracket, then go to the first. So we select the first cell, and since it will be moving in that column, we block the J so that it can move in the rules. So we block J. So if it's equal to the name is equal to A4, and also the condition that is equal to Kumasi, so we'll select the city. It will be moving in the, so we'll block the column, so that to move in the rules, so K5, equal to the city, Kumasi. So we are saying that the condition in which we have our name to be A4 and city to be Kumasi, we should highlight it, give it a font, let's say a light um, green color, then we select OK, then we select OK again. So automatically we can see that if y is duplicated, so the conditions where we have if y in the city commerce it will be duplicated, we have if y commerce it will be duplicated. Assuming that in here we change Fred, which is Accra here, so we change the name to Fred, and we change the city to Accra, we see that Fred is duplicated here, which is highlighted. We can apply this conditional formatting to the rest of the column. So assuming it's here, and I, assuming I'm doing an entry where, let's say, I'm entering um, Kwabena, and I go to City, and I enter Kumasi. So the moment I go here and select, change it to Kwabena, and Kumasi, it will be highlighted. Thank you very much, and continue to follow us. On this page, Fred Excel. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye.